All right, it's Monday, December 24th, and that means it's time for another Movie Pitch Monday. So for today's Movie Pitch, I'm actually gonna be borrowing an idea from Grant Morrison and Dan Mora for Klaus. I think this would be an awesome movie. So I'm just gonna read you the description of, of what they have here. Set in a dark, fantastic past of myth and magic, Klaus tells a story of how Santa Claus came to be. Where did he begin? What was he like when he was young? And what happens when he faces his greatest challenge? Drawing on Santa Claus's wilder roots in Viking lore and Siberian shamanism, taking the creepier side of Christmas and characters like sinister Krampus. Claus is Santa Claus year one. Yeah, I think that would be a really amazing movie. Have some like badass Santa Claus dude, maybe like, I don't know, like Hugh Jackman or something like that. Um, and he's just, you know, it's set in this kind of dark, fantastical world where there's, you know, um, magic and uh, it's like a different world and he, we kind of learn about his origin stories. I, I don't know, how, I've only read two books of Klaus, so I don't know like how they tackle this issue, but I would have some sort of transition from this kind of early um, rugged loner days where he's kind of fighting evil and, you know, doing right in the world. And he's got to face this like demon or something like that. And maybe the the reason he becomes Santa Claus is because to keep these demons at bay, it's like to create, you know, uh, if, if say there's like a balancing scale, if happiness in the world trumps like sadness or something like that, maybe it keeps the demon at bay. So, you know, once a year, this guy gives presents to all the children and causes a bunch of happiness and hope and you know celebration and really like families coming together and this keeps the demons at bay so he's done this like selfless act of like you know i'm going to continue to do this uh until you know i run out of the will or the resources to, to continue to do it and you know he you know lives in isolation because he is some sort of savage the way he looks and like the the kind of PR around him. Maybe that's not his doing. Maybe he's just this like badass, rugged, loner dude. Maybe there is no Mrs. Claus. Maybe he's just this dude that, you know, modern marketing has put this like positive, jolly spin on him, but you actually meet him. He's like, you know, still kind of like that badass dude. So the arc of the movie is really about, you know, his early days, year one, um, we transition into him kind of fighting evil, learning about this, this duty that he has to kind of spread joy in the world. So in the end, I would have him kind of toiling away at this seemingly never ending task and his own kind of passion for it is declining and maybe the Krampus or whatever, some beast returns to this dimension and fights Claus in this kind of heroic end of the movie battle and he defeats him kills him so he actually no longer has to deliver presents to to the world but now he's developed instead of like it going from duty he's developed like this new passion and he does it from like the kindness of his heart and does it just to do it because he knows how much joy it brings people and maybe this is where he starts to like become changed as a person he becomes jolly and puts away some of his demons. So there it is, my pitch for uh, Klaus, a dark, twisted kind of Christmas movie, totally stealing the idea from Grant Morrison, uh, but I think it'd be a really awesome movie. And, you know, I've only read two books, so I don't know how much my version is similar to their version, but, but in the interest of full disclosure, completely give them credit. Merry Christmas, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. If you liked the video, please hit the like button. If you wanna see more pitches like this, please hit the subscribe button and I'll see you next time.